Hi, my name is PJ of PJ Tackle Limited and I'm here to show you how to set up our patented soda float product for use. On a sunny, cold day like this at the Island Pond at Sam Hostick's Fishery, there are plenty of spots for the fish to hide and with that in mind, accuracy of feeding will be paramount to catching anything. This is achieved very easily with the soda float because your loose feed always lands with your hook bait. First though, we have to set it up and it couldn't be easier. Soda float stands for self-opening displacement action float and it's attached bottom end only, just like a waggler. So just thread your line through the molded eye and lock it in place. Here I'm using split shot, but you could use float stops if you prefer. Then attach your hook length, plumb your depth and you're good to go. Here I'm going to use maggots. So first I will bait my hook with them. The main difference, big advantage of the soda float is that it takes all kinds of bait instead of just one type. Bait like pellets, sweet corn, hemp, ground bait, chopped worm and luncheon meat can all be used without the need for different floats, making your life easier to just get on and fish. Just take the soda float and put any bait you want into the bait housing. So now we're ready to cast out and hopefully catch a fish. <laughs> 